name is Jay Napoleon. Thanks for watching. Uh, before we get into this new sneaker I just got, I'd like to say uh, I appreciate you guys watching. Make sure to subscribe to the channel. Make sure to like, hit the like button. Uh, look me up over on Instagram. It's uh, J underscore Napoleon underscore. Find me, follow me, comment on whatever you like. Hope everyone's having a good day. Today is a day after the Super Bowl, and let me just tell you, I was really disappointed on so many levels. But shout out to uh, Julian Edelman. Hand off to Edelman, sweeping left across the 45, and Julian goes there for an over Gronkowski. He's uh, from around the Bay Area. He went to my high school. He's a little younger than me, but he's made a hell of a life for himself. And uh, props to you, bro. All you Patriots fans out there, congratulations. Belichick's too good of a coach. Tom Brady is too good of a quarterback. And yeah, anyways, let's get into the sneaker. Uh, wait, should I just tell you? Or should I just show you? So these were a collab. These came out um, about a month ago. Here's the box, probably can tell. So as you can see, this is kind of like your standard Nike uh, slide out box. But the color is obviously, hopefully you can see the color. It's kind of like a peach, kind of like a salmon color. It's actually really nice. I really like this color. Let's slide these out. Let's see what we get. Oh man, these look these look so tight. <laughs> so these are the Nike Air Skyline 2 Fear of God collab. And they are crispy, crispy white. And off-white too. Man, these are these are so nice. I'm a sucker for maybe it's because I was born in, in 83, but I'm a sucker for these because kind of like a retro collab releases. Uh, especially a brand like uh, Fear of God, they sat for hours actually for that day, and I told myself that I was that I wasn't gonna get them unless they sat, and they did, and so I copped them. Shout out to the homie who copped it for me, uh, Josh. What's up, Josh? First of all, they come with extra rope laces, and apparently they come with flat laces, but I don't see them, so uh, somebody just shade me out of some extra laces. <laughs> These are kind of like off white, uh, kind of coincide with the outsole and midsole color. The side panel is mesh along with the toe box up here. And some of, uh, kind of like the heel over here, some mesh up here. Towards the front of the toe box, there is this kind of like grayish, kind of like off-white grayish color here, but this is uh, 3M. So if you hit that flash, you'll probably see it. You see the 3M pop. So we have uh, this felt kind of synthetic suede here, kind of wraps around the toe box and in the heel. And then we have a perforated tongue as well. You have a really nice touch here on the swoosh. It's kind of like patent leather. It's not like Jordan 11 patent leather, but it's pretty nice. And on the inside sock liner here, you'll see really kind of nice leather. On the inside, you'll see that has a little tag, kind of like neon green tag. It says recrafted. What that means is like they pretty much Nike got rid of some of the, the molds of an old shoe like this, and they would have to basically go off old drawings or they, they call like, you know, kind of like uh, influencers or, or sneakerheads or uh, to send them the original pair of the shoes so they can just go off so they don't actually have the mold anymore. So when they don't have that, they usually put a little sign that says recrafted on there. I thought that was pretty interesting. Another really nice detail that they have. So a lot of the Nike Air branding for this collab, the Fear of God font and the font is actually, um, or at least it reminds me and from what I've, what I heard Jerry Lorenzo say is that uh, he tried to kind of like emulate the Nike Air Flight like 89's font on here so I thought that was really awesome and it's also on the insole itself. Oh, how can I forget the, not sure if this was uh, an idea that he had that, uh, that decided to go with. Uh, it just reminds me of, a, you know, the Jordan 5's have this lace lock. Uh, not this one's particular but a lot of old shoes back in the 90's did have that. A little nice detail there. So yeah, they have, there's not much else to these shoes. So if you're wondering how these fit, they fit true to size. I wear a size, pretty much I wear a size 13 and a half. These are 14, they fit great. Now, since we talked about the shoe and we talked about the materials about the shoe, I thought I'd just show you what they look like on feet. Since I can't go outside, since it's raining, stupid weather, I thought uh, I'd just put them on here in my house. I hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching. I appreciate all the love, all the likes, Thanks for subscribing. If you haven't already, go ahead and hit the subscribe button. Follow me over on Instagram. It's J underscore Napoleon underscore. And I'll see you very soon, to be honest with you. I got some stuff lined up. Hopefully you'll like it. I got some sneakers coming in the mail. I think they came today. So, whoop whoop. <laughs> Until next time, I love you all. Enjoy the day. All right, peace.